Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to show you all the Fluff Mountain Cloud Keys. So this is going to be the guide and I hope everyone enjoy it. So before I start the Cloud Key Guide, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and also I will be doing a live stream 2 hours after this event has started. So don't miss it and if you have any kind of questions about any kind of tricks that I am teaching, you can go over there and ask me, okay? So let's check all the cloud keys. So we're starting from this first one. This cloud key is going to be right after its side. It's going to be the uh, life essence. Let me show you. So this is going to be the tiny life orb, the level one. You can get it by harvesting the life flowers. Let's check the next one. This one is going to be one of the lost vases. By merging this kind of objects, let me show you which one is going to be that, that one. That one is going to be the Amphorae, the level 5. Merging the level 4 as you can get it. Let's check the next cloud key. This cloud key right over here is going to be one of the last ones that you are going to get is the golden capsule. The golden capsule is going to be found right over there. So for this one I don't think that we need any kind of image because you know that is going to be the only object. So be careful to not touch it when you are going to move it, do not to open when you are moving it, okay? Let's take a look at the other one. This other cloud key is going to be the nest that is also at the end of the map. Let me show you. If that one is the Safiri nest, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, here you go. That's the Safiri nest. And let's take a look at the next one. For this cloud key, it's going to be a Vermilion Dragon Tree that you can get by merging the lower levels like these ones. Let me show you. So here we have it, the Vermilion Dragon, Dragon Tree. Let's see the next cloud key. This cloud key is going to be the Grapefruit Tree. It's a higher level of these ones. It's the level 4. The Fruit Tree level 4 can sometimes tap for grapes. Now let's check the next cloud key. We could go over there, that is going to open. And we can have that cloud key. And let me see the other one. Yes, that one is going, going to be the next. So for this cloud key, it's going to be one of the uh, the vases, let me check the name. It's going to be the Dragon Tears, the level 3. Let's check it again. Yes, it is. Now let's check the next cloud key. If there is any other before. Seems not, but we can already talk about that cloud key that is behind. That is going to be the Elixir of Life, the level 4. It's one level further than the previous cloud key. Let's check the other one. The cloud key that you can see right over here in the side of that potion is going to be the last level of it. The Wishing Star, you can get it by merging the previous levels. And let's check the next. Right over here. Let's get the name of this one. If I'm not mistaken, it is Three Graces. Yes, it is the Three Graces, the level 4. You can get them by merging Twin Flowers. And let's take a look at the next cloud key. This one is going to be the Round Fluff. You can get it by Merging burrows. Let me show you the image. 
When you merge the ground fluffs, you get soft fluffs and then the round fluff. And then we also, when we are merging the burrows, when you get that flip things, there is going to be one of this cloud key. The level 4 is Nug Shelter. So remember, by merging the tiny burrows, the neat burrows, cozy burrows, Nug Shelter, and, and Shade Enchanting Cave, if I'm not mistaken the name, you can get the flip things. Now, this next cloud key, right behind the cave, that is over there, you need to destroy the zomblings and they are going to give you the shes and then the sequence of the chain to get that one and by destroying the zomblings you get the funky blue cheese then you can keep merging it, get the glowing crumbs, foxfire, tiny spirit vial and from that the fancy spirit bottle that is going to be that cloud key over there and after getting that, you, you go for Mystic Lantern. And when you touch the Mystic Lantern, you will get another uh, chain. And the Spirit Rose chain is going to be used to open that cloud key right over there. And that is the Dark Rose. In the previous event, we also had to... Uh, open another cloud key that it was for the spectral, spectral rust bush so you can keep merging the dark rose to get that one and we also had to get the next level of the fluff things that was the snug fluff let me check if I have missed any cloud key for what I have seen uh, it seems that I didn't miss any but if I did you can go at my live stream and ask me, you can point me which one you are missing and if you need uh, advice how to finish this event very fast, I will be giving a lot of tips and tricks and even teaching how to get a lot of points very fast. So, I hope you have enjoyed this video and I'm, I'm sorry that I, this time I was not able to do a, a mass healing, but if I was doing this kind of thing, I would have to keep my points and this is a problem because I want to start fresh new in the event for everyone in the live event. Okay? So, don't forget, hit like button, subscribe and pretty soon we will be doing the live stream. See everyone in the next video.